What's up, YouTube? Back with your boy Luke, live from Bogota, Colombia, with a webcam model today. Gentlemen, what we're going to do is we're going to interview this girl, and we're going to learn the odds and ends and outs of all this webcam model stuff, and we're going to do it all right here. If you're new here, go ahead and smash that red like and subscribe button at the bottom of the screen. If you're a returning subscriber, thanks so much for being here. Give me a thumbs up, and let's jump right into this. All right, guys. First and foremost, I want to say that I met this chick on one of the main sites and talked to her, go back to my basic rules, get the Facebook, become friends. All of a sudden, I'm down here in Bogota and we're doing a live interview. Okay, guys. So first and foremost, I want you to know she works in a webcam studio in Bogota, right? She works in a studio with a lot of girls. So I'm going to ask her about that and ask her about the money and we're going to jump right into it. In the studio donde trabajas, ¿cuántas mujeres trabajan ahí? There's 10 girls that work in that studio. Por turno o no más? Sí, por turno. En cada turno hay tres mujeres. Mañana, tarde y noche. Okay. So there's three shifts. There's a morning, afternoon, and night shift. Three girls are usually working each shift. And ¿cuánto es el más dinero que has ganado en un día? How much is the most money she's ever made in one day? En un día, eh, lo máximo que he ganado son 500 mil pesos. So she made 500,000 Colombian pesos in one day. Y, and I'm going to ask her, 500,000 Colombian pesos en dólares, ¿cuánto es? Como 150, that's, a, dólares. that's about $200, 150 to $200 that she made in one day, okay? Now that was her cut. The house takes a 40% cut. So she gets 60%. Um, y en un trabajo normal aquí en Bogotá, ¿cuánto tiempo tardas en ganando ese dinero? Hmm. 200 dólares. Eh, unos 20 días. So, she made more money in one day in the webcam studio than she could make working like 20 days at a normal job. Just a regular minimum wage job or whatever it is down here. Um, let me see what else I'm going to ask her. I'm going to ask her about her clients now. Are they... Are they Mostly male, mostly female, or are they, um, you know, couples and what the clients ask her to do? We're going to get into some details. <clears throat> de tus clientes, um, casi todos son hombres solteros, o hay parejas, o a veces hay mujeres clientes, o como están? Eh, de todos, <clears throat> tanto hombres solteros, casados, pareja, o mujeres también, claro. She said she gets um, everything. She gets... Single guys, married guys, she gets couples, guys and girls that, that want to do things, uh, want to see things, and she also gets girls too that want to um, that want to see things. Now I'm going to ask her, um, what's the weirdest thing or the craziest shit she's ever seen? ¿Cuál es la cosa más loco que has visto? O que babosada y media quieren ver o que que Practícame de, de, de unos locos que, que quieren. Lo más loco, eh, yo creo que es el sábado masoquismo. Eh, llegan eh, hombres con la intención de hacer sufrir a las mujeres. Que se amarren cadenas eh, en el cuello, que se peguen con látigos en los senos, eh, que se quemen los senos, que hagan show de vela, que uh -huh. suban la vela y caiga el... Ellos hacen eso. eso. She said there are guys that will torture themselves on camera for her to watch. Like they'll take a candle and they'll put the hot wax on their chest and stuff like that. And, and just, just like bondage and, and things that are, you know, pain. And there's also guys that like to like, um, you know, do things to girls too. And she said it, you know, it, it, there might be willing participants, but it, it looks painful and, and it's kind of scary like that. So I'm going to ask her now how many days a week she works. ¿Cuántos días por semana trabajas? Eh, seis días a la semana. She works six days a week. And un turno es ocho horas? Eh, sí, turno es ocho horas. And a, a turn is going to be eight hours. So, ¿y hombres trabajan ahí también? Sí, inclusive ahorita hay un hombre... Uh -huh. Y él trabaja tanto solo como en pareja. Depende. Aunque le va mucho mejor solo. 
She said there is a guy that works there, and he works with his girlfriend, but he also works solo by himself, and it, he makes a lot more money when he works by himself. I would think that other guys probably want to see that. Y la mayoría de sus clientes son, son gay? ¿Son hombres que quieren verlo? No, la mayoría de sus clientes son mujeres. Wow, she said that actually the most of his customers are girls. So these girls are paying money to this guy to watch him do things, and I would guess they're doing things on the other side of the webcam, you know, to, for themselves to be happy. And I'm going to ask her right now how much longer she plans on doing this. ¿En cuánto tiempo piensas en seguir haciendo eso? <laughs> La verdad, yo creo que, yo no, no digo la fecha, o sea, hasta cuando ya definitivamente me canse o logre lo que realmente quiero en la vida. ¿Te gusta la, el trabajo? Sí, yeah. sí, sí, me gusta, claro. She said she likes the work and she doesn't have a day or a time picked out that she's going to quit, that she doesn't really want, know what she wants to do with her life and she's just doing it for the hell of it right now. ¿En cuántos años tienes? 22. So she's 22 years old, so... You know, um, it is what it is, and right now she's just kind of having fun and making more money in one day than she could make in two or three weeks in a normal job. And I'm going to ask her about customers right now and if they send her gifts, if they meet her, or, you know, am I the only one? ¿Te mandan regalos y cosas así tus clientes o no? No. Nunca has conocido uno, no más un cabrón en el Marriott Hotel con una amiga. Sí. <laughs> no, she said that I'm the only guy she's met, and um, and nobody, you know, really sends her things. Pero a unas mujeres sí mandan regalos. Sí, sí, inclusive allá en el estudio sí hay chicas que les mandan ya sea dinero por PayPal o obsequios, celular, uh -huh. reloj. She said that there's girls that get uh, money sent to them by their customers outside of the website, like on PayPal, and they also get gifts, uh, UPS or DHL, to the studio. Llegan regalos al estudio. Yeah, you know, so these gifts will get to the studio and things like that. So, you know, there you go. Let me ask her if anybody knows. Nadie en tu, tus amigas ni tu familia si saben dónde trabajas o no? Eh, sí. Mis papás y mis, mis amigas, unas pocas. Ajá. Uh -huh. Yo, she said, yeah, her family knows where she works and they're cool with it. Uh, her parents know and her her friends know. So, there you go, guys. I hope uh, I'm going to look at this and make sure I didn't miss anything. Um, I think we're pretty good right now. We went over how much she works, what she makes. Uh, she works alone. Uh, we talked about the studio. And um, I really don't have any more questions for her. She was... Um, told me what people like to do what you know the craziest stuff that she's ever seen things like that the guys burning themselves with candles on camera for her to watch so um hey guys i did it i came down here straight to bogota colombia snatched this girl right up out of the webcam studio got an interview with her she's totally cool um smash that like and subscribe button if you hadn't already done it like i said she's making about 150 bucks on a good day and that's her cut so, you know, she's kicking ass and taking names and good for her. So I wish her the best of luck in the future. And buena suerte en el futuro. Y gracias por la entrevista. Okay, bye. Bye.